Hello, let's do uh, G67 4.8 AV number two, the uh, dilation sheet here. So in this uh, first section here, we're finding the coordinates of the vertices of triangle A prime, B prime, and C prime after triangle ABC is dilated using the given scale factor. Then graph the triangle. All right, so let's go ahead and graph this. We got one, one. We got one three, and we've got three one. All right, so I'm just gonna graph that guy in here. Now we're gonna use a scale factor of three. Um, so if we've got one one, we've got. One three, and we've got three one. We are going to use the scale factor of three, so we're going to multiply each coordinate by three, and so this is going to be a prime. B prime and C prime. Uh, well, take a look at it. If we take 3 times 1, it's 3. And 3 times 1 is 3. So this is my new point here. Graph it in green. 3, 3 over 3 of 3. This is A prime. And we've got. 1, 3, so 1 times 3 is 3, 3 times 3 is 9, so we've got 3, 9 over 3, and up 9, so this is 3, 6, 9, here's B prime, and then we've got 3, 1, so this is going to be 9, 3, so here's 3, 6, Nine. Here's going to be C prime. So we'll connect those. Oops. I have to go up three. three. Sorry about that. There we go. All right, let's try something else here down at the bottom. Now we're looking at a segment. Segment P prime Q prime is a dilation of segment PQ. Find the scale factor. Well, what we need to do is take a look at one point, and I like to take the easiest one. I always take ones in the, this quadrant here. And we'll look at Q. The coordinates for Q were 2, 2. Okay, for Q prime, you can barely see the prime mark, but you can see it there. They had 1, 1. So, how do we get from 2 to 1? Well, the scale factor is 1 half. Whatever you multiply it by. So we can check P2. P is P is negative 2 P prime negative 2 and it is 2 4 negative 2 4 and this one here is negative 1 2. You can see that the P coordinate is exactly half in both cases. Alright, good luck on the rest of it.